everybody. Welcome to another edition of Wolfie with Valley. Today, I'm going to be doing something a little different. So today, I'm doing live action how I'm going to assemble this thing I bought on Amazon. I had been looking at it for a while. It's a newer four-in-one reflector system, but it like attaches to a light stand. It's not the pop-out reflectors. I wouldn't need to show you how to do those unless you don't know how to put it back into the bag, which some people, I actually did once need a video for that. Now, what this is, this is a stand-up system and it comes with zero directions, zero. So I was interested in it because of the black and the white. I can use it for reflecting or for flagging light. It also has gold and silver, which I may never take out of the package unless I want the silver side. Comes with these, these four uh, sticks. And then this thing, which is what holds it all together. And I'm sitting here going, how does this thing work? And there's no instructions. So we're gonna do it together here. And the first thing is, oh, I gotta get the damn rubber band off. Okay. So we're gonna do this together. And if you decide to purchase this thing, it's about $65 on Amazon. If you have a studio, I think it would be great. But I don't think you'd wanna take this thing outside. So the first thing I'm doing is I see that, I don't know how well I could show it. One side has like these little thingies, and the other side does not. I'm going to assume that these little thingies are what keep are the side that goes into the, the fabric. So I don't I don't know what I'm doing. I can tell you that I, I think I was right because when I shoved them in there they don't go through. So I'm gonna start off by popping the little thingies into the fabric. And then I'm assuming I'm gonna pop all this stuff into the other piece, into the adapter. Okay, so I've put the four corners in. And now I've got this lovely thing. Ow! Okay, so it's got holes on the sides. I'm assuming that this is where the four things go in. This is clearly where it attaches to the light stand. And this is clearly gonna adjust the angle. So we're gonna try and see if I can do this and no cursing. I could do this, I could do this without cursing. You know, some directions would have been nice. Like, what order you, what order do you stab these suckers in? <clears throat> like, I don't know. It's weird. Ah! Okay, so I'm gonna try and pull this closer so you can see. It actually seems to be coming together easier than I expected. There we go. And of course, one side fell out. I'm gonna go ahead and get that shoved back in. Ah! Okay, I'm on the verge of cursing. So far, I'm not, ah! because every time you get one in, the other one falls out. I'm gonna tell you guys right now, the Amazon reviews are correct. This thing is a bitch to put together. There, I did it. So this is it. It attaches to a light stand now through the back, right here. So you could kind of see <clears throat> how everything attached. Basically, I laid all four pieces down 
and shoved one end into each hole and fought with it a little bit. And now it's working just fine. Um, I like that you can use it either vertical or horizontal or at an angle because it's got ad adapters for all, all sides. So that's really cool. And um, I'll be using this in a shoot sometime soon. But I hope this helps you if you decide to buy the knee or uh, reflector, four in one stand up adapter reflector, whatever the hell they call it. It's a little confusing to put together, but it's not too, too bad. As you can see, I did it in just a few minutes. So thank you for joining me for another episode of Coffee with Allie. And I'll see you next week, Fridays at three o'clock. Have a great day.